welcome back and i'm going to show to you today how to configure matic on the metamask web wallet why is this important because matic now known as polygon is an amazing network and cheap in gas fees and very very fast so we want to be able to make use of that by some matic tokens and the first step to do that is to set up a custom rpc so open metamask in your drop down over there once you've installed it and as you can see what we'll land on is the Ethereum mainnet at the top here. This top bar explains what network you're busy using and there's many different networks associated with different blockchains. Now, if you want to make use of the Matic network, what the documentation tells us to do is to click there and actually scroll down to the bottom where it says custom RPC. So let's do that and let's click there. When you do that, you will be presented with a screen like this, similar to the left side. And now we're just going to basically fill in the fields. Please make sure that you get these fields absolutely correct uh, because you do not want to be uh, adding a random network to your MetaMask. So first things first, we're going to add the Matic mainnet. And then we're going to add this. So please be sure to make sure this is very, very accurate. Uh, this needs to be exactly the same as the one on the left because otherwise you'll be pointing to a different network and you do not want that to happen. Things like the name, you can call it maybe, you know, V2 or just whatever you want to identify the network on your MetaMask. But that's, but this field is very important. All right. Now we're also going to enter the chain ID just as important as this URL. So chain ID and the URL, please get that correct. And then we can move on to the symbols. So symbols, if it doesn't populate there automatically for you, like you're seeing my computer busy doing, that's just because I've entered these before and sometimes MetaMask picks it up, um, sometimes not, I don't know why. So just make sure that you copy exactly these fields and then we can hit save. So once we've done this, MetaMask will automatically switch to this network and we are now busy using the Matic network. So if I close this, we can see that I actually have some Matic tokens on the Matic Polygon network, which I'll get uh, to the next video to show you how to buy these tokens and how to make use of the Polygon network and the dApps that's now on the Polygon network. But just an important thing, again, just to clarify, this is a different RPC, which means it points to a different network that's why you be able to see different tokens here. And uh, if we switch back to Ethereum, you can see that there is our Ethereum, our Ethereum tokens. So, well, uh, coins, right? So uh, basically that's how you do it. So whenever you enter a dApp and they say you have to be on a Polygon network or the Matic network, you can simply then go to your MetaMask, open it. So click, open MetaMask and then just choose the Matic main network and you'll be good to go. And the DAP will automatically then pick up that you're on the right network and you'll be able to utilize your coins once you've connected your wallet. And that's it. Hope this video was informative. Please leave me a comment in the description if you need to know anything else. If you want me to show you how to set up the test um, RPC, I'll do that as well. But the next video will go around how to buy Matic tokens on the Polygon Matic network. See you then.